Hey guys and welcome back to another Pro Clubs Goalkeeper Tips and today I'm talking about the question that a lot of people have been asking recently and it's something that I've been waiting to cover and it's something that I'm now ready to cover because I've been, fit I've been testing it out the best I can. I didn't want to release a video explaining it until I actually gave you guys the best answer and experimented myself. Um, so like I said in the past, I literally do these videos on my own. I don't have a team of people working with me um, or giving their their opinion as well on the best tips. Um, it's literally me. I'm, I'm the only one who does anything related to this channel. Um, I'm thinking about starting to collab with some people, but I don't tend to collab. I've never done it either. So I wouldn't really know who to collab with and what sort of videos to do. So if you guys have any suggestions, then let me know in the comment section down below. Um, also, do you want to start seeing some more vlogs as well? I've got an idea for a goalkeeper series. Um, I'll probably talk about it in a vlog coming up very soon as well. But jumping into the tips today. So, um, a lot of people have been asking when to use the B save or the A save. And personally, first I'd like to say, I don't actually use the A save at all whenever I play FIFA. Um, for long range shots or any of the normal saves, I normally choose the right stick, left or right. Um, obviously use Y to come out to come out to the player in the 1v1 situation. But the thing that people have been asking, what's the best save to do in those 1v1 situations when it comes to diving at their feet? And what I've been figuring out is that using the stick isn't actually the best save to do unless they shoot before you actually get to their feet. Obviously, you, hit, you have to use the right stick or the left stick when they're going to shoot just before they get to you. Otherwise, you'll just flop on the floor in front of them. But what I found for the best technique to diving um, at their feet is actually using B. Um, obviously, you can use X as well, but B is the more reliable. Um, it literally just goes, to, it just literally dives down at their feet and kicks the ball away or swipes the ball away. And it works really well. I don't know if you guys have actually figured that out or tested it yourself. But it's what I've found and what I've found works really well. And a lot of people have been waiting for this video and waiting to see when about to use it. Um, so the best time to use it is when you're literally about a few yards away, maybe one or two yards away. When you, you're pretty much really close, you're, you're like up close to them. Um, you don't want to do it too early for the reason being that you would dive at their feet and they'll just kick it over you. Or they'll kick it around you. Because it's not a save that can, that can save left or right really. Um, it's more of a save, like I said, which will just get the ball away from the player's feet. Um, so what the thing is to do is go onto the skill games and go to the level 3 skill games. And actually try using it in that. Um, it's, the, it's the skill game where you've got a selective amount of players on your left, your right, and also your center. And they run at you. And the best thing to do is not stay on your line. Come off your line, come out to them, and just dive at their feet. Give that a try. Um, it's what I do to perfect this technique. And it's what you guys are going to be seeing in the background as well. It'll be me diving at their feet. Um, and also just trying to show you guys the best things to do in a 1v1 situation. So hopefully this, guys, this has kind of helped you guys a bit. Any questions regarding this topic, then let me know in the comment section down below, and I'll do an advanced video on this on this um, on this technique of saving. So just let me know in the comments. I'm more than happy to do another video explaining, um, because obviously it's quite a hard thing to kind of get the hang of unless you're really good at it. So let me know, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Adios.